Hello again, everybody. Back over here at the new house. Uh, figured I'd give you a little update. Uh, been working on the RV, and uh, it's back out front. I'll walk over there in a minute, but uh, thought I would share what has been on has been done on the house real quick. As you can see, all of that bamboo that was right behind the house is now gone. And it is a bunch stacked up there. So quite a few of it, quite a bit. They did some grading out here and uh, let's see, I saw a big four or five foot snake out on this uh, dirt pile earlier. I don't see it anymore. But, backfield is uh, mowed. And uh, like I said, they did some grading out here. But, uh, yeah, walk back to the RV. That's what I've been working on today. And uh, yard looks different with all the, the grading being done because up here was sloped down like that, and so now it's all flat. But uh, yeah, been working on the RV today. And uh, uh, last week, some got all of the striping pulled off, and starting to look pretty good. Took forever. You can still see where the stripes were, but uh, definitely looks different. I ended up buying one of those 3M eraser wheels, and that helped a lot of it. Um, but I'll show you what it was doing. It was pretty much, let's see, get it in focus. It was melting the pinstripes and the stripes, and it was leaving this residue. So, what I've been doing is going over it all with acetone, and it has been taking it off. I've done this part right here all the way to the the vent there. I've not done the top right there, but you can see I did do this side. And the whole passenger side has been done with the acetone. This right here I'm going to get all that off when I get ready to sand and caulk all around everything again. Uh, so that's why like up on the top I'm still leaving. You can see some right there because the windows have been, I went over them right when I got it to stop any leaks. So I don't want to peel that off and leave a hole there until I'm ready to redo it, so. But I'm having trouble with this bottom. It's so sticky, there's so much residue on it that the acetone's actually not really doing anything to it. So I gotta 
find another solution to that. And that's the same with this bottom stripe right here. But everything else came off pretty pretty good. But yeah, you can still see the shadow. But once it's painted, it's gonna end up looking pretty good. And the eraser wheel, I'll show you that. This is the 3M eraser wheel. And it works pretty good, but it's, it's a slow uh, process. I would recommend um, your RV has, the stripes are only good for a certain amount of time, so I would suggest pulling them off uh, when it comes time for that. Don't let them sit there for 20 years if you plan on keeping it, because you'll have a heck of a time getting them all off. But uh, yeah, that was just a little update, and uh, hopefully I can get some more done and get that ceiling done here soon. But uh, yeah, thanks for watching.